Hi friends, this is Ramana. Today I will show demo on some interview questions for SQL developer question. One of my friends recently attended for interview. The interviewer asked for some simple questions. Even though he has experience in six years in MS SQL Server, but he, he, he confused to answer these questions. So what is what are those two questions? So how to find the first and last day of the month and how to get the same result using left hand subscreen function. So without wasting the time, let's jump into the demo. So first I will answer the first question. How to find the first and last day of the month. So select There is one function called the date function called date from parts. By, by using this, we can get the desired result. So today, actually, the date of the today is April fourth, April second. Sorry, April second, twenty twenty two. So now I, I want to get the first date of the first day of the this month, April month. This is the first day of the month. So by what I am I did here is date from date from parts is the one function is there. It will accept three parameters: one year and month and the the numerator I have given is one. So the, the the date part I will take here is the get date. Today, get date means today's date. So after including the year and the month of the and one parameter, you will get the first day of the month. At the same time, you used to get another function called Evo month. Evo month nothing but end of the month. End of the month get date. If you execute this query, again rem remember uh, today is April 2nd. So this is first day. This is first day is April first. Last day is April thirteen. I am using get date from as a date from date function. And Evo month is end of month and date from parts. The function called date from parts. I use it for getting the first day. So this is how you will get the first day or the last day. If there is a Another way called declaring the variable also. So I am declaring one variable. Declare date is my data type, and I am giving some uh, random. November, November month and 
17 to the day. I am executing the same query. Get from parts. The year of a date. Then we have to run the query simultaneously. See here, I am taking the date. Date here is seventeenth uh, November, twenty twenty-two. Earlier we took the get date. Get date nothing much. It was date it is April second. Now I am declaring a variable and it can take the value as John. November 17, 2020. For that, I want to get the first day of that month. That means I am again using the date from part the function and pass the declared variable in year and month functions to get the first day. So again, I am using the same parameter for last day also. Evo month. Evo month means end of month. Passing the variable date as I am running all three at once. Earlier. When you run the get date function, we need not declare uh, variable separately. Now, in this case, I am declaring variable and get the result uh, as per the question. So, for getting the first day and last day. So, first day is eleventh, eleventh one, and the second day is thirtieth of the eleventh. 2022. If we change the month, instead of 11, I am taking 2. Too much February. The first day is February 1st, and the second day is February. 28. So uh, I am taking the leap year for 2024, which comes in the leap year. Let's see the result plot. Date 2029. 2024 February 29 and 2024 February 1st is the first day. This is how you will get the result for first question. How to find the first and last day of the month? You have, you have to find with the get date function and also by declaring the separate variable for date function. Now we will see second question. That is nothing but substring and left. So interviewer asked here to get the result. He wants to get first three characters of the first name. Now here in the sample data, I have six columns: ID, first name, last name, email, gender, and currency. Interviewer asked 
to how to find out the first three characters of the um, first name here. So I am writing the first left function first. left of first name. function ask two arguments first one is expression and second one is three three means he asked for the first three letters of the first name so to compare with the first name i am uh, including this uh, first name name also in this select statement so that you will get clarity so this is my query while running this query observe so carita cir is the first benedetto ben is first kindrick ken is first three madiana mir is the first three letters eriella ar is the first three letters monaro is the mon is the first letter so i want to get the same result by using the substring function also how to get select first name comma substring substring as function as three parameters If you run this query again, it will get the same result. There is no change. First one is with left function and second one is with substring function. I am I am running this uh, same left query both left and substring functions. Left I am giving some alias name.
So if you get if you get clear distinction this two. So first name. He asked to get the first name of the first three characters of the first name. So here is the first name and then by uh, by applying the left function I am getting this result and by applying this uh, substring function I am getting this result. There is no difference between left and substring function. If you think uh, as per the uh, requirement, both functions will work to get the desired result. So this is how you have to get the simple questions for, for getting how to find the first and last day of the month. For, we, we have to declare one variable and uh, date function. We have assign some value for the date function. By that way, you will get the first and last day. At the same time, we are also getting using the get date function also for first and last day of the month. And coming to the left hand subscreen, we have to we have to get the results similar result by using the left and right string functions to get the result. So this is a very common simple question, but at the time of the interview, interview. The interview candidates might get confusing to answer all these things. Thanks for watching the video. Hope this video will understand you better. Thank you very much.